right now. What do you think then about the Conor McGregor situation, him being pulled from the UFC to Conor does what he wants. Conor does whatever he wants. And if Conor wants to retire, Conor can retire. He's got totally set spit fire. I don't know if you guys have seen it. But if the man wants to retire, he can do whatever he wants. But, but, shout out, you know, good thing the UFC was like, yo, you know, if you're not going to come to the press conference, you know, we're going to have to pull you. Then Conor's like, sweet, thanks for the cheese, I'm out. That's, they're just both doing their thing. Do you agree with his behavior, Conor's behavior? Do I agree with it? I mean, look, I've flown to Australia, coach for, you know, I've flown to Australia, to, I've flown from Seattle to LAX, LAX to Sydney, Sydney to Brisbane, Brisbane to Melbourne, Melbourne to Sydney, Sydney to LAX, LAX back to Seattle, trained for six weeks, did the same thing and fought. So, you know, this is how I, this is how I make my money, this is how I pay my bills. And ever since the UFC's ever asked me about anything or asked me to do something, I've never turned it down. You've been champion longer than he's been in the promotion. As a champion, do you feel like you should, you should be allowed to kind of make the, use those liberties to call your shots a little bit? No, I never thought so. You know, my job's to fight, and you know, when the UFC asked me to do something, I'm like, all right, sounds good. I can I can make that happen.